How long have you been in America? Since 1970. Okay. How I'm is American it? American citizen. How is it different than Ooh. Bermuda? Bermuda's friendly. Interview with my grandmother. All right, so we're here live with my grandmother from Bermuda. Um, where did you live when you came to America? Sound First. Road, Somerset. Okay, well, was that is that South? Like, could you have like a Southern accent to your Bermudian I have a, a, a accent. British accent. I know, but you have a weird Southern way mixed in somehow. No, Why? Know. I don't know. I was born that way, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, I always want to understand where that came from. Um, but I'm going to interview my grandmother. Um, and um, how long have you been in America? Since 1970. Okay. How I'm is American it? American citizen. How is it different than Ooh. Bermuda? Bermuda's friendly. Surrounded with balmy breeze and blue water. Blue water. It's not Pink friendly. Pink sand. It's not friendly here? Uh, not like Bermuda. But, um, you know, I came here because I married a guy who was stationed in the Air Force over there. Yeah. So I bought his children and... Uh, and what was he, he like? Was what was he was in the 303rd Air Refueling Squadron in the Air Force? What like in Bermuda? What ethnicity? Like what race? Mix. He was kind of mixed race. He looked. I don't know. He said his somebody was white on one side and whatever else on the other. I don't know. But he looked like he was half white. You used to tell me he was Puerto Rican. Yeah, mix. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> she don't know. That's why my children are beautiful. This is why I took a DNA test. Um, what what kind of test? I, I, did, take I, test? I took one. Oh. I have to share it with you, actually. Well, it said I was. My uh, children are mixed, and um, I got. It said that children. I was six six percent Chinese in my DNA now test. my my father is Chinese, and my mother is black. So my children are mixed and pretty and handsome, and all my grandchildren are mixed and pretty and handsome. I made everything. God made everything from my seed. Handsome and beautiful. I don't have nothing ugly in my family. And if I did, I'd still love them. <laughs> Anyways, so my grandmother was a model back in the day. She did pageants. And, and then in the... Um, what they call you? You, you told me they called you what? Remember? Uh, I ran in a beauty press, uh, pageant twice. I represented Miss Bermuda. You know. But you told me they called you like Black China or something. Oh, uh, Black Chinese. Yeah. Because my father was Chinese or whatever. You whatever. said they used to call me Black China. That's you all that on there? Yes, this is being recorded. Lord have mercy. <laughs> and um, I, I remember. Don't look, I don't look like I look now, you know. I was I was pretty black gal. Yeah. And uh, <laughs> <laughs> 85, now, you know, age takes away your beauty. Speaking of 85, um, and uh, like you, since you used to say, like, I remember. You used to say, like, back when you were, like, 75, um, whenever I would ask about something, you are like, I'm 75 years old, I'll do what I want. So, <laughs> <laughs> I so, have my license to do what I want so, at 85. So, I guess you're still doing what you want. This isn't reason, no. You know, <laughs> as a Christian, I don't do what I want. I, do, I try so to do what So, what you be Jesus wanting to do stuff do. that you shouldn't? I try to do what Jesus wants me to do. Now, don't forget to put that in there. Um. So, my I'm question not, is the... um. Christmas lights. Why won't you take them down? They're always out. Look, y'all. Because I love the that. I love the beauty of my blue lights. Blue is my favorite. That light blue is my favorite color. I don't take the blue lights down. I keep them up all year round. It makes me feel happy. You do if that, if happy. people don't like it, well, they can go where they live. They can go on somewhere. Go on where they live. Honey. That's what she says. Um, is there anything in your language that is different than how Americans would normally speak? I just have an accent. She don't even know. She be saying random stuff. I used to get in trouble for not responding, but the truth is, I didn't know what she was saying. Like I didn't know. Oh, I, I speak she, well. No, now. no, but I didn't know. I didn't know what you you were saying. You used to like be like, I said, do it, knob, and I'd be like, knob. <laughs> what does she mean? I'm gonna take your ball. <laughs> and and you'd be like, knob, and I'd be like, what is she asking me? Okay, you, you were trying to say and... now. You yeah, were trying to say now, but I didn't, I didn't, you were saying like, nov, and then like, she was, instead of saying you all, she'd say, you lot, you lot better come downstairs. <laughs> and, By the way, why are you, why are you, uh, what, what are you doing? 
Uh, trying to find out my little life story. I just thought it would be fun. With these rags on. I'm going to my garden rags on. Oh, yeah. She has a cool garden. Oh, um, I got my I can, garden rags on. I can on. show you. Why didn't you wait when I'm dressed up? I don't know. It just came to me. Ooh, I should show you guys um, her walk-in closet. Do you want to give us a tour? You can go ahead and do it yourself. I'm not moving. But it's fun if you do it. Come on. This is going to be memories. This is good memories. Oh, that's going to be on Facebook? Uh, maybe. YouTube, something. Whatever. It's funny. You... Oh, by the way, I have a friend who thinks the word whatever is rude. And I told him it's not rude. No, it's not rude. I got this. Exactly! But, okay, come well, on. Well, you know, it's like, if you tell me No, so... just say it's not rude. That's all I need. <laughs> she made a walk-in closet. And it's really just a bedroom that she turned into a... Um, I'm going in your... Room. I don't know where the light is. It is in the ceiling. The ceiling. How much? But where's the switch? Right there. Straight ahead. Oh. All right, y'all. So this. Right, look at this, y'all. Hold on. Let, let me tell you what it is. Look. So, let me tell you what it is. These are my Sunday shoes. <laughs> this is my round the house shoes. This is gifts for my church uh, sisters and the Lord and my family. This is my Hurley Communion garb. <laughs> She has this is my Easter outfit for everything. Shoes and parking book. Okay, like, look, but for real though, look at the, she has like, wait, am I getting that? This is shoes to match the dress, the purse. And the white skirt. And then even look, she has the purse and the shoes to match. She has a whole like. Look, right here. Mm-hmm. The okay. skirt to go with that. Look at these purses. Though. I don't lend my clothes. I want. Can I borrow a purse? One thing I don't do. <laughs> I'll I'm give just you, kidding. I literally no, don't care. So it could be on there. I don't lend my clothes. I'll give you my money. I don't lend money. I'll say keep it because two to one, they forget they borrowed it. Whoever it is, sometimes. Pocket books and clothes and shoes. I don't lend. I'll give it to you first. Oh, can I have it then? I'm not ready. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care. I don't actually want it. Um. <laughs> um so yeah, this is the purses and this is the walk-in closet. Just tell them what it's called. Walk-in closet. Walk-in closet. I don't lend my purses. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, oh, library. She's like Belle. You take my this. library, child. I oh, study. Oh wow! Ooh, wow! What's this? What? There's a little. I lay area. on that to pray. Aww. And then she has like. A lot of books and I have a library second to none. Oh, and look, there's her other stuff. My suits. This one's not as like pocket cool, book, but you know. Okay. So, anyways, this is my grandma's house, and um, she recently turned 85, and so I thought it would be fun to introduce you to her. And um, I'm Naomi Elizabeth Marie Farrell. I didn't know that. <laughs> I, I did not. Yeah. Uh, I guess we both have four names. <laughs> my name's Gabrielle Solange Caris Travis. I'm named and Farrar is actually her my married name. Her married name that she kept. Now but what's plan. your maiden name? Summons. What? Norma Elizabeth Marie Summons you, Farrar. You told me it was Asin. Asin is my father's name. Your father's Asin and then Simmons is what? Simmons then why? is my mother's name. So you took her name? Got both. So then what's your name? Norma Elizabeth Marie Simmons. My daddy is Essene and Farah is my married name. Okay. Um, okay, I see. That's my run around class for, for, you know. So she has like three closets, as you see. All right. And you, you have seen. Oh, more like. Now, see, now she wants, she wants me to do it. Library, honey. Library. So this is more stuff. Do you lend books? Or you don't lend I books? I don't lend books. I will give you a book. It's not a library then. Because libraries make you, they lend. It's a personal library. Mm, okay. All right, there's just a few more things I need to show you. So if you didn't notice with the walk-in closet, she kind of makes signs. But just they're for everything. So, okay, what, what signs do you want to show us? The one in the bathroom first. Oh, gosh. As you sit on the toilet. Oh, gosh. So this is the toilet. <laughs> Look, do you guys. Do not leave your boo-boo bits. Wow. It's embarrassing. <laughs> this is why I didn't have a boyfriend when I was younger. She had a sign that literally was like, no boys upstairs. I'm like, oh my gosh. 
That's the Earl Hugs. Yeah. Okay, so this, these are the lights that I told you about that she doesn't ever take down. Ooh. Pretty. Wow. You want me to, uh, it's a wonderland. Experiment? Okay, you explain what? The signs. Oh, yeah. So I actually took a picture of the signs earlier while it was light outside. So, Nanny, um, so but here's the signs when it's dark. And then I will show you guys a picture of it when it's light. So, Nanny, explain these signs. This spot is for Jesus and me only. <laughs> Smoking your cigarettes and your weed in my <laughs> Jesus only spot <laughs> is off limits. This is my sacred holy spot with Jesus. Norma for all. Second one, do not get on my last nerve. Stay out of my section. Means stay out. <laughs> Stay out, stay out. You better listen. You better listen. <laughs> and is all that gonna be on there? Who who is that to exactly? Who are you talking to? Um I'm talking to anybody that the shoe fits. If the shoe fits, honey. Wear it. Alright, you guys. And now you have totally seen my grandmother's house. Auntie, did you wanna say hi? So I'm just having the Okay. <laughs> Alright, you guys. Happy birthday, Nanny. Thank you, May you live to see many more. May you live to see many more. With Jesus. With Jesus. Amen. Amen.